So if is everybody don't you have some someone missing? Okay. Okay, we can start, it seems. All right, so the next speakers, uh, could you pronounce your name? Uh, sorry, Wong. Okay, so yeah. that's it. That's it. <laughs> and the, the other the other presenter? Uh, the other presenter is Peter Xie. Good, good. So yeah. that's <laughs> rather than my kind of uh, pronouncing myself, <laughs> it's, it's better to uh, let the authors pronounce their own names. Okay, so the title of the next talk is on the yet I shift alternation in boundary cross consecutive conditional. Please start. Okay. Yeah, uh, uh, thank you. Uh, we are from National Tsinghua University, and uh, perhaps uh, my speech will be uh, not so fluid because I'm a bit nervous. Uh, uh, anyway, uh, our research is on the high uh, shi alternation in mandarin consensus conditionals. Uh, and uh, in mandarin, the English even if conditional such one A, uh, even if the typhoon will come in, the fly will take off, corresponds to the Jota content, which as shown in one B consists of the anti particle, Pai Shi or Ye, as well as the Mohi Uh And at first glance, uh, it seems that in this construction, these two anti particles, Hai Shi and Ye, are in free of nation. But in fact, uh, if we add specific context to those conditionals, we will discover uh, the stronger, but uh, sorry, uh, a contrast in their alternation. Uh, firstly, let's look at the uh, free alternation cases, such as two. Uh, the context say Wang and Li are going to attend a wedding, however, they are going to be late and they're trying to figure out how to get to the venue on time. Uh, one says, if we don't take a taxi, we'll be late. And the replies, even if we take a taxi, we'll be late. In the expression of this concept of conditional, either the use of policy or year is okay. Uh, also, uh, for the Joseph functional in two, we make a we make a comparison between two types of situation, namely whether or not the speakers take a taxi, the dialogue. Uh, secondly, let's look at the, the other cases where the alternation of high shi is blocked. Uh, in the same context, one say if we take bus, we'll be late. Well, if we take the MRT, we'll also be late. And the replies, even if we take taxi, we'll be late. In the expression of this consensus conditional in matter, uh, the use of here result in infelicity, as we can see in 3B. Also, uh, in 3, we change the comparison into one among three types of situation in a dialogue, taking a taxi, taking bus, and taking the MRT. Uh, okay, uh, in the overview of the two types, we observe that uh, the alternation between high C and Ye sometimes is blocked, Sometimes it is free. Uh, and what problem this research is to solve is just why sometimes the alternation between high and D is blocked, why sometimes it's free. And we suggest that it may be accounted for with maximized optimization and alternative pruning. Okay, uh, after the introduction, we should move on to the discussion of the composition of Mandarin, even if. Uh, Goes on link 2007, as you said, uh, the even if conditional associated with focus and introduces an additive transition as well as scalar one of likelihoods. Uh, as we can see in four, uh, and, and even if conditional, even if P then Q introduce, introduces an additive transition, they say uh, some of the alternatives. Other than the pre-JSON, if P then Q is true, and the scalar optimization, they say, is uh, in comparison with all the other alternatives, the pre-JSON, P then Q, is the least likely one. Uh, take one A, for example, with the pre-JSON, uh, 
if the typhoon will come in, the, the flight will take off. The other uh, presentation is some of the alternatives other than that if the typhoon will come in, the flight will take off is true. And the scalar presentation is uh, in comparison with all the other alternatives that if the typhoon will come in, the flight will take off is a least likely one. And we assume that uh, the matter in Joseph functional, just like his English counterpart, also carries an analysis composition and a scalar composition, uh, which in which we assume Joseph gives rise to the scale one. Uh, so a Joseph conditional, Joseph P then Q, uh, introduces a scalar composition, which says, uh, in comparison with all the other alternatives, the, the projection AP then Q is the least likely one. And also introduces an its uh, assertion that says uh, all the alternatives to the projection AP then Q are true. Uh, let's take one B for instance. Uh, with the uh, projection uh, in English uh, in English version, if the typhoon will come in, the fly will take off. Joe uh, Swan introduces a scalar position which says, uh, in comparison with all the other alternatives, that if the typhoon will come in, uh, the type the fly will take off is the least likely. Uh, and the an assertion that says. All the other uh, all the alternatives to that if the typhoon will come in, the flight will take off are true. Uh, also, uh, we assume that um, in Joseph conditions, the energy composition is brought out by the energy particle, Kanshi or E. And these two energy particles contrast in the computational force, as we can see in six. Uh, in a Jordan conditional, it supposes that some of the alternatives other than the rejection is true, whereas Hai Si presupposes that uh, all of the alternatives other than the rejection are true. Namely, Hai Si has a better presuppositional strength than Yi. And again, uh, let's take one B for instance. With the projection, if the typhoon will come in, the fly will take off. Uh, the attitude proposition from high C says that all of the alternatives other than that, if the typhoon will come in, the fly will take off on she. Whereas the attitude presupposition from Ye says that some of the alternatives other than that, if the typhoon will come in, the fly will take off is she. Finally, uh, in light of the crisis style theory of conditionals, we assume that the large form of a Jordan conditional, such as 1B, is constructed as in 7, uh, in which uh, probe is a signature pronoun and the conditional model operator represented by wood is a signal semantic type, ST, ST, ST. Uh, Okay, um, then let's move on to the topic, then uh, to our topic, the automation between high C and A. Uh, firstly, we provide uh, the account for the automation block cases such as we buy a bit to maximize the position, which forces which speakers to use the presupposition of stronger alternative. When it introduces the same assertion with its competitor and its, uh, its presupposition is met in the context. So, uh, yeah, uh, in, we show we show it in uh, eight here. Uh, also, we assume that uh, less single scales of presuppositionality, such as O versus both and a versus the Generate those conditions between arguments. Uh, let's take uh, let's take O and both for example. They introduce the same assertion as we can see in nine, but both additionally 
uh, introduce uh, introduce as a uh, presupposition. This may uh, this may both presuppositionally stronger than O, and in turn, the presupposition of both is met. So, according to uh, maximized presupposition, the speaker uh, is forced to use both to express. Uh, also, uh, and we suggest that uh, high sin here likewise form a presuppositional scale here versus high C, and assume that the infelicity of the chosen functional with here in three result from the application of maximized presupposition, just like the case in ten B, uh, as shown in. Uh, then uh, I will explain how maximized realization works to uh, 3B. Uh, as shown in 11, uh, Jordan Conditional either with high C or yeah, introduces the same assertion. Also, uh, 3A, uh, as we can see below, uh, asserts that both of the two contextual selling alternatives. Uh, below, below the oh no, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, the two contextual selling alternatives to three B uh, are true. Uh, namely, the presupposition from high Shi is met in the context. Um, as a consequence. The speaker has to use high C, the computer with a better position of strength to express the uh, Joshua functional according to maximized position, as we just uh, say, I mentioned, sorry. Um, uh, however, even though um, the condition based analysis implies that speakers should always use high C to express uh, Joshua functionals. Uh, there are still cases such as two, where high C and Y are in free alternation. This implies that we need another account for this free alternation case. And based on the aforementioned completion based account, we suggest that in these free alternation cases, a mechanism that we call presuppositional, uh, presuppositional scale truncation saves the use of Y. By removing high C from being its computer set, uh, which has the same spirit to alternative pruning. Then, uh, given the positional scale here versus high C, without high C of the computer, the use of here is no longer subject to maximize position, nor will this chosen functional to be to infelicity. Uh, Moreover, to take both of the two types of, of cases into account, we assume that the truncation is subjected to a constraint which would be assumed associated with contextual relevance of positionality as shown in 13, uh, which, uh, in other words, states that uh, the truncation can apply to save the use of it in chosen constraints. Only when the certification uh, satisfaction of the essential transition from yeah, suffice for suffice for, suffices for the satisfaction of the transition from high C in the context. Uh, let's uh, furthermore explain how the truncation applies to the chosen functional in two and why it doesn't apply to that in three. Um, according to the context of two, uh, we show we show below uh, the, the alternative set to the chosen function of two B has two to, uh, has two members as we formalize in fourteen. Uh, if B then Q, if not B then Q, since this set has only one element other than the three JSON, and they uh, did not be then Q. The alternative, the additive composition uh, from high Shi or Ye has the same value as we showed in 15. Uh, then the uh, satisfaction of the composition from Ye 
suffices for the satisfaction of the realization of high complex in two. Uh, therefore, the truncation may apply to the Joseph functional to be and save the use of it. Uh, on the other hand, according to the context in three, the alternative set to the Joseph functional conditional VP has three elements as we formalized in 16. If P and Q, if P prior than Q, and if P double prior than Q. Since this set has two elements other than the free JSON, uh, if E prior than Q, if E double prior than Q, the additive proposition of RC or E in 3B has different values uh, shown in uh, 17. And thus, the satisfaction of the proposition from E does not suffice for that of the proposition from RC in the context of 3. Therefore, uh, the truncation cannot apply to the Joseph function of 3D, and the maximized proposition follows and forces the speaker to use as to express. Uh, as a result, we conclude that the relation between Tai Sei in the Joseph function is subject to maximized proposition, maximized presupposition and presuppositional scale truncation. And furthermore, depends on the size of the alternative set. When the alternative set has more than two elements, maximized proposition applies to the Joseph functional and blocks the automation. Whereas when the alternative set has exactly two elements, with positional scale truncation may occur and free alternation by aborting the competition. Uh, okay, let's go for my presentation. Thank you very much. We have, um, let's see, a uh, lot of uh, time left and we are for 30 minutes or so. Okay, uh, so let's see. Uh, first, I have an announcement that uh, the uh, participants uh, are uh, people participating on, online hear your voices through this mic. And so when you are asking questions, could you speak up a little bit so that the data is clear? Okay. Hello. I'm Alexa Kaiser. I'm a question. Could you go back to the, to the first page? Okay. Yeah, two, yes. Uh, examples one and uh, examples, I did two and three. We show contrast with the availability. Uh, Compatibility with the DA. So, two is compatible with both the high share and DA. I think example three. Okay, could you go? Okay. Go, yeah. Uh, yes, the context is three where only uh, high share can be used, but the DA cannot. This, I think it should be in 3B. 3B. Oh, so, oh sorry. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So, there is a contrast between like. Uh, whether it yeah, can be used in these cases. But I think another possibility for both scenarios is that we can use both yeah and high shi. So yeah, high shi. Um, so even if we take a taxi, um, we yeah, high shi will be late. This is possible for two, this is also possible for three. So it looks like there's no incompatibility with the use of yeah and high shi. So, can this be a point? Uh, yes, but uh, this doesn't. Uh, uh, let me think, sorry. Uh, yes, but we consider this a case of complex complex activity. So, uh, for example, in uh, another case, another example. Uh, such as Dian, Ye, or Dian Hai Shi, uh, Dian, Ye, or Dian Do, uh, we can say, uh, Lian Zhang, uh, Lian Zhang Dan Ye Do Zhi Dao, um, Lian Zhang Dan Ye Do Zhi Dao, Yi Si Mian Lai. Uh, in this case, uh, uh, it shows, even though, uh, Do and Ye, Contrast 
uh, they can be used together as well. So this does, doesn't uh, demonstrate uh, high C idea or not in a country. So it's three year alone. I also feel like it's not good, but but the high Yes, because uh, after high C tells the position of the so as long as you include that strong yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's what I mean. Thank you, sorry. No, no, <laughs> thank you for your help. <laughs> oh, man, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I meant split. Chris Plain, yes, I meant split in the pre Chris Plain. <laughs> Other, uh, other questions and suggestions? Okay. Um, uh, kind of two questions, but like the, the simpler one. So this predicts, of course, that there are no cases where uh, yeah, it would be good and uh, high show would not be good. No. Well, okay, please elaborate. <laughs> So there's no cases. Oh, is that a yes or a no? Like, so there uh, would there be cases where you can use yeah, but you cannot use high ship? Uh, um, uh, I don't think so. That's predicted by the problem. Yeah, but. Okay. But uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, examples from uh from Chinese like Zhang Zhang Yan, it's just like the Japanese more like A more B more can be Yeah but that can be like yeah can be used high should cannot be used. But this is not uh a case in conditioner. Well I think they are different. Yeah. And and then the, the two two part question, second part uh you you gloss them as still and also, right? Oh yes. Why is that? Uh, because uh, uh, because all of the uh, cases where yeah can be used, I see can be used. So we uh, we uh, so we assume uh, I see has a has a stronger um, I don't know how to say that. I'm oh, sorry. Um, uh, has a stronger position than it tell yeah. yeah. And and that's the same with still and also. I'm not so sure. the English okay. still and also. But was that like? Are you also kind of trying to say something about still and also? No, no, no. Okay, okay. That's just for convenience. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Um, sorry, coming back to this. No worries. Um, so, um, I'm, can you go back to examples two and three? Okay. Okay. Um, so, I think given the, the semantics you provided and the maximized presupposition account, correct me if I'm wrong, but when you use yeah, there should only be two. Alternatives. Yeah. Were the there three or more you would expect to use ice? And yeah. your example, so example three sets it up so that there's two more alternatives than the one you're mentioning. So they've been mentioned in the discourse context. So when you add the third one, there's three live alternatives, right? Well, there's two alternatives to the okay. The so my question is in example two, where yeah and ice are both fine, one alternative has been provided by A. And B is sorry, sorry. So two is like a yes no thing. So you don't take a taxi or you do take a taxi, right? Okay. So imagine you change it so that instead of saying, you know, oh. you get what I'm saying. So go ahead, focus on three. The the A has provided a bus and they provided MRT, and then you say, Yeah, even if we take a taxi, we Taisa will be late and we yeah will be late is bad. Yeah. But what if A had not mentioned the MRT? So imagine w, uh, the W, I should say, says, if we take a bus, we'll be late. 
And yes, then, 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 then use of here is okay. Okay, so does it implicate that there are only buses and taxis? That's my question. Because you might expect that if you use yeah there, you're suggesting that there's really only two alternatives uh, that you're taking into consideration or that should be taken into consideration. Do you get my point? Like, you mean, in, yeah. is, it, is it a kind of accommodation? Or? Well, so when you talk about alternatives, here you've provided discourse alternatives and then you're responding to them. But sometimes when we deal with alternatives, you're just generating. So when you put focus on a word, you're leaving it to the hearer to oh. tell them what are the alternatives. Oh, yeah. And, and, and you might expect that when you use yeah, you're basically saying, there's only two alternatives to consider here. The one I'm saying and something else. So my question is, is that true? Mm, you mean, uh, if we, you mean if we do not add a uh, specific context? So, so in three, uh -huh. you take off MRT, uh -huh. now yeah is good, yeah. right? And my question is, Sorry. if you use ISA versus yeah, in your so so W says if we take a bus we'll be late, and L says even if we take a taxi we will be late, and they can say either Heise or yeah. And my suspicion would be from your analysis that if you choose yeah, you would be suggesting that there are only taxis and buses. Oh yeah. And if you say Heise, you're leaving open that there's other possibilities, like MRT, for example. Yeah, so it, uh, it's possible. Uh -huh. that, that would be an interesting possible consequence. Of yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yes. Sorry, my explanation was bad. No uh, worries. Uh, <laughs> exactly. OK, we have three minutes left. Uh, three minutes left, one and a half. So that in that case, then then ah, let's sign the speaker again. Oh my god, my father is not my Yeah, some of something. Yeah. Uh yes, uh um uh, in other cases we can see uh the user high to predict uh they might be there might be uh, more than two alternatives when we do not uh, specify the context yeah as you uh use as okay. you question yes so that would be an interesting contrast if you when you write the paper <laughs> to make a three but with or without the mrt and then compare the implications or the implication that's generated uh, also, uh, the use of here usually carries uh and in inference of Activity of the uh, consequence. An inference of what? Inference of activity. Oh. Yes, of the consequence. Mm. Okay, I think those three be not answer your point. So you are suggesting that when you use a high ship, the kind of conveyor you mean that, that you do not look beyond the, uh, this, and uh, that's all the possibilities that you will consider. And, uh, no matter what possibility you consider, you will always be there to this kind of thing. So with with also maybe there there are other possibilities that are not taken into consideration, but with the use of hash, so with the use of hash it suggests that all the possibilities have been taken into consideration and uh, they all lead to laziness. Is this something like this? You so, mean, uh, I mean that after this high shoe, you cannot add more things to the same. And then after year, you can still add more things and say that they also need to the same. So taking a bus, there will be latest. Taking an MRT, there will be latest. And uh, taking a taxi, there will high should be latest. And if you no longer consider anything beyond that, because there's always the things. It's this kind of meaning, but just with all, just with the year, there's no this kind of inference. You can add more things. Add more things. 
So like L keeps talking. Yeah, it's like the tax overlay, take MRT overlay, take the well, we didn't take this into consideration, sorry. Uh, but Um, okay. Oh, sorry. I I don't know the, how to answer this question. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, uh, time is almost up, and so I, I hope that you can have a further discussions at the other times. Uh, thank you for your comments. Thank you.